And I continued going to the library. One day, when I went to the library, I also see another diagram which was explaining how electric bear works. So after seeing that diagram, I decided to build a salt blader to prevent my house from burning if the wires cross together. Because all of my wiring was made of completely bare wires, they were not insulated wires. So I was afraid that if they cross together, they can cause fire and burn my house. So because I didn't have money to just go to the shop to buy a light switch, so I had to make my own. And I was also able to make the light switch so that I can turn on and turn off the power, rather than me always disconnecting wires if I want to turn, it, uh, to turn off the light and connecting it back if I want to let up the light. I just also want to just push the button just the same way where everywhere where people have the electricity do. So my windmill that I that I made, it was the only like tallest structure in the area that people were able to see from far away distance. Sometimes when people see the windmill, they'll ask me, what does this do? I'll explain to them that this windmill generate electricity uh, that you can also be able to use to power up your cell phone. Some people at that time had cell phones. They will say, could we try to charge our phone? I say, of course. I plug in the phone and it shows that it's charging. I say, now you believe me that this can charge a phone. Could you please take your phone? They say, no, 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 no. We won't believe you. We'll believe you when the phone will be fully charged. <laughs> so they just want to get their phone charged for free. Most of the time, I was just like leaving them. So this windmill little, um, little helped me like to solve some of the problems that we are facing at home at that time. When I first get into uh, this room, I don't know if all of you have noticed, it. we have like a windmill there. That the, uh, it's just like the same, looks like the same windmill like the one that I did, but this one is made out of, uh, the blades are made out of uh, um, wood. But it, the way they, they have done with the wood, it just looks like, just like the same as the, my windmill, the one that I built here. So, I've been like, uh, since I made that windmill, I've gone through, uh, I've done like so many other uh, things in my community, and I've also had a chance uh, to travel and share my story in different platforms uh, all over the world. I was able to uh, write a book, and this year, Netflix just picked up um, my book to make a story, a movie about my, uh, my story, called The Move, The Boy Who Harnessed the Wind. So I'm very happy like today uh, to share with you the trailer uh, from the movie. Thank you.